Hi everybody, so glad you're with us. Everybody's been waiting for these two to meet up. Now they do as round one is underway. Took a shot, now he gives a left. The other day when we were talking to Andre Bishop, he said to have success in this fight, I have to land combinations. He landed a good one there. He got all into that one. That was a solid uppercut. Tried to land that upstairs, was off the mark. We've talked about this time and time again. When you get these two mentalities squaring off against each other, it should be a brawl. Yeah, the old times would say about these guys, they get insulted if you miss them. Tyson's now feeling the after effects of being rocked by a huge hook to the head. Good left hand by Andre Bishop. I think Bishop scored really well there. He just damaged his opponent with that power shot upstairs. What a damaging blow. Nice hook upstairs. Tyson's opponent here is not known for being a guy that can really go deep into fights. Doesn't have a lot of stamina. Well, Mike may make that very easy and good marriage for him. Yeah, that works perfect for Tyson because that probably means that his opponent is going to come out of bed. He's going to be desperate early. He knows he can't go late. And Tyson loves to get a guy early. The way these two are going at it early on, they're going to break the punch that computer. Well, they're trying to break more than that. They're trying to break each other's will. Huge up. Big shot there. Andre Bishop rushed by that power punch. Bishop is down. He went down from a big shot. Now he's got to have some big guts to move along. You're going to find out exactly what he's made of. Count down the final moments of this round. Damn, that one. was some bullshit. Tyson's in what control now, good? scores a knockdown in the last round. Teddy, you think he's going to go after it here when this next round starts? Well, I'll tell you, Joe, he should. I think he should because that's what the networks are looking for. They're looking to bring back guys that are excited. There's no better way to ensure that they're going to bring it back than scoring a knockout. He has an opportunity. Yeah, opportunity to advance his career. Unable to steady himself right now after being stunned. A three-punch combination scores. Nice work by Mike Tyson. He's showing what a skilled fighter he is with this counter punch. He takes one, gives one. The right hand scores well. Took a shot. Now he gives a left. Good combination to the body. Missed the target with that hook. Oh, what a harsh jab that time by Andre Bishop. Andre Bishop. 
Halfway through this round here. Fine looking right hand by Mike Tyson. Teddy, he's trying to punch his way out of this damage he's incurred, but that's not the answer. No, he's in a range storm. He needs an umbrella. And instead, he's running right out into the range. Oh, he just misses with that headshot. Final minute of this round that has been nothing but two straight minutes of non-stop fury. That's new seatbelt. More turbulence to head. DeAndre Bishop. That's a solid, great combination. He is down on the mat. What will happen now with Andre Bishop as he rises up to fight on after being floored? A huge right hand from Mike Tyson. Scoring well with that combination by Mike Tyson. Tyson's movement helped out there. He avoided that punch. Goes up top with a right hand. And the round comes to an end. We did have a knockdown in that round. Now, Teddy, if you're in the corner where your man was down on the floor, what are you telling him? Well, the first thing that I do is I sit him down, I get water on the back of his neck. You know, I bring him to a sense, I make sure that he's clear and everything. And then I tell him why he got his backside put on that canvas so he can correct it. And he doesn't go out there and get caught again with the same punch. Now, that is fighting right there. It's smart fighting, landing all four punches. That is a sharp uppercut by Andre Bishop. Bishop's going out there after just being knocked down in the last round. If you're standing opposite him, what's the mentality? What's the strategy here? Well, you want to go after him, but you don't want to walk into a trap either. You want to kind of size him up a little bit. You want to see if he looks like he's okay, but at the same time. Oh, Bishop got battered right there. Bishop was absolutely battered right there. The one thing he's got to do is stay away from that right hand. Mike Tyson with a big score there. Accuracy an issue there. Didn't land that straight right hand. There's the hook. Really on the mark with that over the top shot with the right hand. Tried the hook, didn't get it. Tyson is starting to score at ease against his opponent there. Anytime you can land a three punch combination, you're really hitting your groove. Well done that time, landing the counter punch. Look at that! The hook came home with ease. And let's show you Teddy's scorecard for the first three rounds. You see, he comes over the top with that right hand. A real solid shot. A crushing two-punch combo by Andre Bishop. Good job with the left hand. It was sudden, it was fast, it was direct by Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson's picking up right where he left off. Remember, him? he is not in good. Big, big shot comes crashing home. How is this going to go on once again he hits the deck? Well, he's getting practice at it, so he might figure it out. Hurry, get up! And somehow, someway, he's going to continue on here. And if he's going to stay in this fight, now he's got to avoid this opponent like the Black Plague. Bishop's landed a good, solid combination. Accurate shot, straight right hand comes in. Able to block that away, it was targeted for his head. Halfway through round number four. Bishop's not coming up with the results that you would want to see out of him. Now he's trying to counterpunch Teddy, but it doesn't seem to be the answer. 
No, he kind of looks a little bit like that guy who went in to get his hair dyed, you know? And he thought, he thought it was going to be just a little bit lighter, and it wound up being a lot lighter. And he said, wow, what the heck did I do? I didn't think I was going to look like this. I didn't think that I was going to box like this. Tyson's not just loading up. He's landing combination punches like he did right there. And oh, what a good, strong uppercut by Andre Bishop. Good flush shot upstairs. Stairs, time and big shot. That was a big shot that floored him, and it's a big shot that may end him right here. That looked like the great pitch of Great Maddox. His sinker ball. Boy, it went down quick. Six, seven, eight. Get up, damn it! Teddy, this is the stuff of legend right now. He is hurt badly, but still he fights on. You know, this is what Custom Idol, my mentor, used to talk about. He used to say, Teddy, when you got two tough guys, but well, one's a little smarter, well, then he becomes twice as tough. Andre Bishop's concern right now has to be the fact that this fight could be stopped if he's going to take more and more punishment like he just did in that last round. Well, you're absolutely right, Joe, but I think his concern goes back a long time. The habits that he learned and did learn in the gym because that's why he's getting caught with all these shots that happen in this position went to the body there but unable to connect oh that's a big hook right there tyson slugging style is really paying off here teddy we're in the middle rounds of these fights and it's clear to me who's controlling this yeah well the reason it's clear to you is he's got the fight in the quarters in the dimensions he wants to oh man you gonna head buddy, man. how about that four punch combination Scored well upstairs with the right hand. Took a shot, now he gives a left. Right on the mark with that power punch by Andre Bishop. There it is! How about that? He goes from being the victim to handing out the punishment. Mike Tyson gets up, but Teddy, you can tell. I mean, just look at him right there. You can tell he's not in good shape at all. No, and I think the key right now is what decision he makes. He made the decision to get up, but does he make the decision to do the things that he can you believe? And bang on, away bitch. he goes. Can he beat the count? Hey, but I don't think so here, Teddy. Now I know where they got hey, that but that. falling like a sack of potatoes. Two. Hey, but me. What's wrong with you? Four, five, six, get your ass seven, up, man. Eight, Come on, get nine, up. Ten. It's over. This fight is over. Mike Tyson's hand to be raised in victory. He scores the knockout here tonight. That's what you want to see. A guy who can close the show. Close the show.